Volete vedere le facce di quelli che stanno cambiando il mondo? Buongiorno. 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 Buonanotte. Buongiorno. <ride> Il Tuscany Lightning Summit del 2023 è stato un evento molto diverso dai soliti, tanto per cominciare zero pubblico e zero biglietti in vendita. Un evento quindi dedicato esclusivamente agli addetti ai lavori, al quale si poteva accedere solo su invito. Una figata pazzesca ragazzi! <ride> Buongiorno! Nella suggestiva cornice del Principino Eventi a Viareggio, uno storico stabilimento balneare costruito negli anni 30 in puro stile Art Deco, si sono riunite alcune delle migliori aziende che stanno sviluppando tecnologia all'avanguardia sul Lightning Network. Abbiamo assistito a una serie di workshop, panel e speech dall'elevato contenuto tecnico, in poche parole, il paradiso del Bitcoin nerd. Explain what your company does to a 10 years old kid. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> to a 10 year old kid. Ah. <laughs> eh, nothing. <laughs> Ten years old. Kid, Ten years old. Which kid. should be. It's me. It's you. Of course. Of course. <laughs> uh, I'm afraid I wouldn't be able to explain even Bitcoin <laughs> to a 10 year old. So can we raise up? Uh, okay. Rage? A little <laughs> bit, but let's put it right. simple. We enable people to use the Lightning Network in El Salvador and soon in other countries. So Relay is an application you can download on your app and you can buy Bitcoin with it. Bitcoin is basically the best money that you can imagine. What we're trying to do is make Bitcoin super easy to use, but we also are trying to keep the ethos of Bitcoin. We want a kid to play a game to earn SAT. We want uh, for someone to pay for a merchant to use SAT. We want to make Bitcoin as accessible, as natural as, as possible to everyone in their own real life experiences. Uh, it's like Calendly plus Bitcoin. So you can register in under one minute, create a public page where you share your calendar and people can book you at the rate you decide and pay you in Bitcoin straight away. RGB is the scam that can scale. <laughs> mm, interesting. <laughs> Relations between economical actors in form of the contracts, not necessarily financial even, and that contracts can run in the scalable, private, and decentralized network. My company helps people learn how to build companies and projects. I'm an open source contributor for six years now. BTC Pay Server makes payments easy without fees and without third party. And Stratum version 2 basically is an upgrade to a mining protocol we currently have. Participating in Lightning Network is complicated with node management, liquidity management by design of the network. So we're trying to create software solutions to automate that for companies so they can actually build or sell their services without needing to know everything about Lightning because you don't want to specialize in payments, you want to run your business. It's a social network for Bitcoiners. So you have to pay to get in. So you can find crazy people like you that pay to get in that are nearby. So you can meet them for a drink, a beer, you know, whatever you want to do. So the membership you can pay with fiat. Okay. Because some Bitcoiners they don't want to pay in 
Bitcoin. Those are not Bitcoiners. Those are fiat coiners with a Bitcoiner mask. Exactly. If you don't spend your Bitcoin, you are a fiat coiner. Non sappiamo più come ripetervelo, Bitcoin è pronto per l'utilizzo nella vita di tutti i giorni. Se volete che il vostro investimento porti i suoi frutti, dobbiamo incentivare il network effect spendendo i nostri Bitcoin il più possibile e ricomprandoceli subito dopo che li abbiamo spesi. Ormai questa cosa si può fare facilmente, con commissioni bassissime e senza KYC. Hodlare fino alla morte significa fare la fine di Gollum con l'anello e rallentare l'iperbitcoinizzazione. Basta, hodl, hodl, spend e replace deve essere il nuovo mantra. So Francis, you made this game, right? Yes. You are the creator. Oh. Yes. What this is all about? It's a, a snake game. Yes. But it's an analogy of the blockchain, so we call it Chain Duo. Ok. Because the snakes look more or less like a chain, you see? Aha, uh -huh, yes. Mm. Uh, let's show them how it starts. Show us Laura. I get a regular Lightning Wallet, Phoenix in this case. I scan this. Then I put a message, my name. Uh -huh. And look. My name is in here now. So fun. It's super cool. And those are your 3,000 salts. Yes. Proof of snake. St I proof told you, it's proof of snake. <laughs> ah, this is the consensus protocol that it's gonna change the world. Yeah. Proof of snake. I'm a content creator and I get excited uh, when I see microtransactions happening instantly on the Lightning Network. Uh, I think, I think Most of the people, they don't realize how disruptive for our entire industry this is gonna be. Do you agree with that? Completely. Value creators own the market. When you create value, you get paid in the new system. And you can start it at fractions of pennies if you want to. And you own your audience forever in this new system. So it's just a, it's, it's a really interesting change from a system where the value extractors get the most to, to a system where the, val the value providers, the value creators get the most. We're developing a way to build peer-to-peer -peer applications super easily where we already have some of the basics in the app, so there's profiles in the app, uh, there's a way to uh, pay people just without even knowing any of their Bitcoin address. People aren't going to be afraid to use Bitcoin anymore. Everyone who believes in, the, in human nature, who wants to do good for humanity, should be interested in Bitcoin. Because Bitcoin is the only way to fix our broken society. Everyone that wants to live a better future for their children needs to be interested in Bitcoin. There's no other way. But also I'm very excited about machine-to-machine -machine payment. For example, you have a car and all the cars can communicate between themselves. But you're late for a meeting, for example. So you say, I'm willing to spend $100 because that meeting is very important. Let my car negotiate with people in front of me to move to the right lane so I can speed to my meeting or something like that. Very dystopian. No, no, this is fantastic. This is a replace by fee made by cars. Exactly. All the services can essentially be sovereign services because you can have, I don't know, infrastructure that pays for itself. Qui al Tuscany Lightning Summit c'è anche una lightning machine che ti permette di cambiare sporche monete fiat in Satoshi. E ora vi faccio vedere come funziona. Inserisco. No. Now you push the button, you scan. The buttons are working for the menus. <laughs> yes! Durante il test con il Lightning Summit non sono mancati i momenti di svago. Sontuose colazioni, pranzi e cene offerte dall'organizzazione, musica fino a tarda notte e tanto spazio dedicato alla socializzazione tra developers. Una forma di networking essenziale per creare spirito di gruppo e condivisione di ideali. Dopotutto... We are legion! <ride> There is a huge world, like the world of money and what Bitcoin is, money, is one thing. 
but the economy requires also a finance. And what finance means the contracts. For instance, I'm producing some goods. I'm run the company. I have shares and have investors, and that's finance. And that's an absolutely valid case because we had shares in yes. companies since the beginning. Another example is the future contracts. I would like to ensure myself as a producer that the prices for which I will be buying goods next time wouldn't exceed and kill my margin. So future contracts is also a valid case. And these all forms of financial contracts would be able to be brought to Bitcoin and that's what we are calling BFI. Uh, you can expect a new, new update on, on the mining protocol itself and hopefully more people will adopt that. And for BTC Pay Server, I guess we have some apps in mind that will allow BTC Pay Server and user to run BTC Pay even easier. So more merchant adoption, hopefully. So the last couple of years, since 2017 until now, we had all kinds of, you know, all oh, ICOs and then... You know, smart contracts, tokenization, DeFi, liquidity farming, all that. NFTs, so we had almost one new trend every year and obviously the VCs were just flocking on there because they could just 10x, 20x an investment <laughs> within a year. And so it was really hard as a Bitcoin-only startup that just grew relatively stable and, and dynamic. Now, kind of, I think, uh, most of the world, the investment world, wake up to the fact that, okay, Bitcoin is actually the signal and all of the rest is noise. And that also shows in our traction, like we have amazing traction in the last uh, couple of months since this whole crash uh, went by. And we also have more interest now from investors. So I think the, 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 the nature is healing and <laughs> the noise is getting less and the signal is becoming more and more. Ciao, Oleg. Ciao, ciao. Welcome. <laughs> Thank yeah. you for having us. Ricky, I'm, I'm really so excited about this event. I feel like better than, uh, than ever after the summit. There is uh, so many cool things going on in the Lightning Network ecosystem. Fulgur Venture, venture capitalists that invest exclusively, strictly on Bitcoin only company. Uh, why is that? We are technology entrepreneurs ourselves, so we tend to look deeply into how things actually work, what is like the engineering foundations of, of Bitcoin, and we believe it's just like design and build for, for what it's supposed to do. We are not the only ones who, who are focused on Bitcoin, and we're seeing more and more venture capitalists uh, entering the space with a, a good understanding of, of how Bitcoin works and how Lightning Networks and what can be built. So. That's, that's an important uh, part of uh, what we're doing, understanding uh, the technology and uh, being able to, to help founders build, uh, uh, build what they want to build. The wind is changing and Bitcoin is ready, right? 100%. Lightning Network is uh, really, really entering its kind of new phase of, of evolution when uh, there is more stuff that can be built, more applications and more use cases and, and monetization. It's just like all coming together. Fantastic, Oleg. Keep up the good work and thank you so much. Thank you so much, Ricky. <laughs> thank you. Nell'ultimo giorno del summit c'è stato anche tempo per una visita alla famosa Piazza dei Miracoli di Pisa. Il complesso monumentale, cinto da alte mura, ospita alcuni dei monumenti medievali più famosi al mondo. È una vera e propria cittadella, quindi, dove gli antichi pisani hanno messo in mostra la ricchezza e l'opulenza ottenuta grazie alla tecnologia. È stata la superiorità delle migliori navi commerciali dell'epoca, infatti, a permettere la costruzione di questo capolavoro di arte e architettura. Mentre passeggiamo in questo luogo unico, non possiamo non pensare al fatto che con Bitcoin, in fondo, stiamo facendo lo stesso. Stiamo costruendo i presupposti tecnologici necessari alla creazione di una nuova età dell'oro. Oro digitale, naturalmente. Oh, <ride> 